All right, so you click on Intro Maker. Once you get here, you will check for the outro that you would like to use. As you can see, there are different types of samples that we have here. And uh, please pay attention. If you see the ones that are written VIP on the top left corner, please jump. That is if you have not made any payment to upgrade. If you are doing for free, just take the ones that are without the VIP inscription. Okay, so let me just uh, click on the outro to see all of the samples that we have. Okay, like I said, if it has VIP on it, jump. Don't select unless you have made the payments. So in this case, I'll just click any simple one that I like. Let me just choose this one for the purpose of this video. Okay, I click on this one. All right. So this is how it looks like. Now let's add some text. As you can see at the bottom of the screen, there's text, title, sticker, music, pictures. You can see these things in the video that I did on how to make an intro of how to add some of these things. So I'll just add text. What do we want to say? Thank you for watching or thanks for watching because the person has watched the video and now the video is actually ending. That is why we are saying thanks for watching. It depends on you again what you want to say. Once you do that, you click OK. Now this is thanks for watching, but obviously we don't like the way it, it, it is showing. You just have to adjust it. You can zoom out or zoom in depends on you how you want it to show and try to position it you can position it on top of those uh, squares the way you would like it to be i've not said done yet as you can see at the bottom of the screen there's layout there's design there's animation now you have to just keep on playing with all the things here depends on how you want your your text to show remember i said if you click anyone that is VIP or that is locked. Here we have some that are locked. It means you have to pay, but I don't want to pay in this case. I just want to do a tutorial. If you click on the ones here, this layout that have locks on them, you have to upgrade. So I'm not upgrading. I will just choose the ones that are free. Okay, let's, let's continue. As you can see, there are many of them that are locked. Let me just choose uh, uh, simple, simple simple okay maybe this one the way it is all right let's go to design as you can see even on the designs as well there are some that are locked so again choose the ones that are not locked just for simple and then yes there's design i've already picked the design layout we've already done it and uh, yeah animation this one, it depends on you how you want it to drop like. Also, some of these are also padlocked as well. So just pay attention. Just pick the simple ones. So I'll just choose this one. It's coming from the side. Or you can choose that one that is dropping from the top. It's up to you. After we have done everything to your satisfaction, you can click done. But I just want to change the color because it does not look clear. Then I go back to layout again. Maybe I choose, but it's so big. Anyway, then you, are, you zoom out to, to adjust it. Then you are satisfied. You click done. Then, as you can see, at the bottom where the text is, now you want to, to drag it till the end. It depends on how long do you want uh, this text to show for like this thanks for watching how long do you want it to show on the outro so i'll just drag it till the end of the outro you see it's easy you just click on the arrow on the end and just shift it like that the way you like left to right as you wish okay we have done that let's just watch how it will show if it's Again, you see how it's located. It's just um, overlapping the boxes. We just have to reposition it. How do we do that? You click on the text just below where it's written here. I clicked on the text. 
and then I try to zoom out and uh, you, you shift it as you like you, you just by the touch of your finger on the screen where it is you just shift it uh, yeah I think this position will be okay then again I think the text is too big maybe that is why it's it's like that I'll, just, I'll let me just change it let me change it to here I think it's okay like this like this but it is blue and uh, the uh, let me do it like yes I think it's okay thanks for watching then you click done again let's play it to see but then again if you can see it's uh, watching is not showing we we'll position it again let's check the smaller text we go to design we check the smaller text no, take this one the smaller one we check the smallest layout that will fit all of those ones are big actually maybe this one but it's blue anyway you get the idea let me just say thank you let me just say Thanks for watching. Yes, thanks for watching. This is so big. It is so big. Okay. Let me click on the text. I'll just say thank you. So for it to just show but normally you just choose the smaller text but you get the idea so i just want it to fit on top of this box that's it so that we can move on with the video then you click done and again i said if you you check it out and you don't like how it is showing you can click on the arrow and drag it i don't want it to to show that quick so now as it is like this let's click okay thank you yes you continue but i would like to write something else on this uh, circle here you can still go to text maybe you write subscribe subscribe yes and then you position the subscribe and how you like where you want it to be i'll just leave it to be this color you get the idea that there's animation there's a design anyone that you choose you go there to pick so i leave subscribe like this then i click done and then i reposition it you just click on on the actual text and position it how you want it to be okay as you can see as you can see it's not under that uh, circle i want it to be you click on the box and start shifting it around as you like so for me it's okay here but then i want it to to be showing until the end of the video okay you click done always and start moving the arrows as you like you want it to okay until the end subscribe okay let's check it out now i'm playing all right thank you subscribe that is it this is how to do your outro now if you like you can always add the music let me just do it for it to be nice now bottom of the screen there's text title sticker then there's music let's add some music we just choose any 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 type it doesn't matter so again this vip skip the vip jump the vip if you don't want to pay take the free let me just pick this one it sounds really dizzy i don't know it let's take something else take me to church maybe okay let's just okay i think this one will be okay so let's add this one as you can see, we play. So if you like the music, 
you leave it like that you just click on you mark it as you can see at the beginning there's a, like a, like you cancel then there's play on your right hand side at the end of the video there's this mark like tick if you like the video you click there i like it so the vid i mean the music so it's there so that is it guys this is how you do your outro now i know why you are here you want to know how to actually end on this box this box that is on the screen like you want to add uh, another video that you would like to show it could be your recent video that you've just uploaded or you want to show that you have other interesting videos or whatever how to do that we are getting there but the first step is done how to do outro we are done here now what we are going to do right now since we are done you check the top of the screen there's the arrow facing the left side then there's edit and then there's this okay this mark like correct you click there because you are done with your outro now it's exporting what we're gonna do now after this we're gonna merge this outro to the video that we have already prepared that we're gonna upload on our youtube channel let me just let it export okay this is our outro forget this so our outro is done what i'm going to do right now i'm gonna go to my to my uh, power director because this is what i use to edit my videos you can use any app that you like that you use to to upload your videos on youtube it can be kinemaster it can be vlogmaster power director like i am using in short it's up to you now i want to match my outro that we just did to the video that we want to upload so let's go I, power director in my case your case can be different okay now we go to new project because i just want to add that a uh, new project is project um, out through okay and then you just choose the aspect ratio i always take this 16 19 now what we're gonna do i'm gonna just choose any video just any video that i want it doesn't matter okay I just want to see what is it hello guys you're welcome thank you so much for clicking okay, and me. thank you for staying so i will just choose this video i'll edit here okay so i've chosen the video that i would like to upload on on my uh, youtube channel this is the one okay after that one now you keep uh, shifting so that you can come to the end what we want to do now we want to add the outro that we have just uh, finished doing with our intro maker now i come here again and click and then i have to check for the outro let me see if it's this one I have to be okay this is the one all right so i edit it's there so what i'm gonna do now i have to play the video to really see if really i i did the job so hello guys i walk okay it's the one i'm just i'll just forward it so that you can quickly go to the outro because this is what i was actually saying okay phone or okay let's do like this screen of my phone okay so our outro is there we are okay with that one what we need to do right now is to produce the video because we want to upload this video on our youtube channel so i click here then i'll, I'll click uh, share on youtube i just have to select resolution then click next okay we just wait for 
the video to finish uploading. Okay, it's coming. It's complete and then to YouTube. Title is a uh, I say testing tutorial. Okay, description. Outro. Okay. I'll just leave it unlisted because. I don't uh, want to publicize it on my channel right now. It's just I'm just doing it for the purpose of this video. So I'll just leave it as unlisted and then you upload. In your case, you just have to come to privacy and click public. But in this case, I'll just leave it like this. And now I upload. Uploading on YouTube. Okay, it's saying this video is ready to be watched. Now, what we need to do is to, because I'm using my mobile phone, is to go to our um, Chrome. That is what we need to do at this moment.